We were just tracking a tornado warning um, out in High Leeds County, so I'm going to bring in Chief Meteorologist Bobby Deskin so that he can give us the latest on that. Bobby, what are we seeing right now? Well, Angelina, we still have the warning. It's clipping the extreme southern part of the Highlands County area, south, well, right in the Venus area. I kind of wanted to start with a little bit of a bigger picture here so you can see what's going on because that's it. That's the main concern right now. You saw this line come through very quickly through Pinellas County. This is the back of the rain. There'll be one or two sprinkles left. But if you're along US 19, almost I-75 and westward, especially Tampa northward, we're basically done with rain for today and thunderstorm chances. And even this line that you see here in southeastern Hillsborough County into Polk County is not terrible. So let me put this into motion for you. All of this moving quickly off to the north and the east. It's moving about 45 miles per hour to the northeast. The line itself is a little bit slower than that. We do have a watch. We have a tornado watch in effect until 2 p.m. It's tr been trimmed back for Western Pasco, Hernando, and Citrus County. And what happens is as the threat goes, they cut this back. The threat is now well east of I-75. So Hillsborough County, I think even Polk County, you're looking pretty good at this particular point. Now, satellite and radar. We will be looking at temperatures basically staying in the mid-70s for today. There's some low clouds left over, but there's a frontal boundary basically right to our west. And that's going to continue to come through the area as we go through the morning hours. So this pushes through. It brings in cooler air and it comes in on some really gusty winds. We've got gusts near 40 now, just regular gusts, not inside the storms. I expect that to continue throughout the day today. We'll get a mix of sun and clouds. It's going to be actually a nice day. But we do have that tornado warning there just kind of exiting now southeastern parts of Highlands County. We'll be tracking that for you here in the Weather Center. Little update to Bobby. We just spoke to dispatch over in Highlands County. They have not had any reports of damage there. We, of course, are going to stay on top of that and we'll keep you guys updated. You guys can stay ahead of the storms. All you have to do is download our free 10 Tampa Bay app. We will send you push alerts whenever bad weather is headed your way.